Hi everyone, welcome back to Pucker Up. So much has happened since I last saw you. The sun is out, shining. My entire wardrobe has converted into maxi dresses. Um, and we opened our show. Guys, we're open. It was very exciting. Um, and it feels good to just settle into the show now. Um, so this is our last episode. And here we go. It's Easter Sunday, which means we have an Easter brunch. Look at this fine array. I know, everyone's jealous. Everyone's jealous. I like FaceTime my mom. We even have a ham. We don't joke around here. We do not joke around. Hi guys, what are you eating? Ham and potato salad and olives mm -hmm. and Italian meatloaf that, that meatloaf. Susan Cook made. Oh, really? That is unbelievable. All right, I'm going to have to get into it have to eat very soon. Um, you know, all of it. The exquisite meatloaf. Yes. Is this the <laughs> meatloaf's the winner? Day. The meatloaf, the meatloaf, meatloaf and, and the ham. ham. You can't even have like for ham. Easter, you know. Happy Easter, everybody. Ah. Okay, what is the tradition of these brunches? Well, Robert Guy started the tradition many years ago, many, many, many shows ago. But why it was important for here at the War Paint, we used to do brunches with uh, Patty at Gypsy. Mm -hmm. And we'd invite other shows to join us, and Equus and Daniel Radcliffe came over. We did a proper tea brunch one day. Mm. And so um, when Patty wrote her memoir, she put Robert Guy and her his fabulous Sunday brunches into her book. Yay! And so when we started here, we were trying to make our layout in the basement of where everything was going to go. We had to decide. Patty said, where's the brunch table going to go? <laughs> we said, yes, we have to have a brunch table. Yeah. So there's our history. <laughs> there's very little room here, but there's room for a brunch there's table. There's room for brunch. <laughs> okay. Tally, walk me through this line right now. Okay. <clears throat> Um, we've got uh, candy, uh, candy bunny rabbits. Oh, I'm supposed to have one of those, actually. Thank you. Okay, great. <laughs> to uh, celebrate um, Easter, yes. we've got a cinnamon toast um, kerfuffle. Oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I love that. Salad for a fiber. That's right. Necessary, um, necessary. Some kind of macaroni salad for. Stopping you up. <laughs> Carbs, which everyone should ignore. <laughs> We've got Absolutely this. not. Ah, and uh, okay, great. <laughs> Gonna hold on that. <laughs> We've got uh, 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 We've got potato salad that looks lovely. Some cheese. Some cheese. Oh yes. Um, so glad you like cheese. Meatloaf. Mm-hmm. Ham. Come on. Utensils. <laughs> and what he's not showing you are the mimosas and cocktails. Because it is pre-show. Because oh. we're not drinking those. No one drinks during a show. <laughs> no, they don't. Breaking news. We have a Broadway debut that happened tonight. Barbara Jones. Well guys, it's time to sign off. Thank you to everyone who has watched. Um, I've had a lot of fun making this, so thanks for, for everyone who's supported it. Um, here's your last beauty mark. The beauty of a woman is not in a facial mode, but the true beauty in a woman is reflected in her soul. It is the caring that she lovingly gives, the passion that she shows. The beauty of a woman grows with the passing years. Audrey Hepburn. Thanks, everyone. Bye.